Hey, this is Hieronymus, and this is a review of the Way Huge Smalls Pork and Pickle Bass Overdrive and Fuzz. It's a pretty cool pedal. Um, this is not a comprehensive review. I want to let you know what I'm doing, though. It's a Fender P-Bass MIJ made in Japan, GHS Precision Flats, and volume and tone all the way up. You know, I could turn the tone down and that kind of thing, but I want to show what uh, the pedal is capable of. And the signal is going through a Boss Bass Parametric EQ, the PQ3B, just to boost some of the lows. Not a big deal. I just want to make it sound good. And let's hear it without the pedal first, without the pork and pickle. That's fingers, thumb resting on the P-Bass pickup. Let's turn on the pork and pickle. This is the pork, the overdrive, with some clean blended in. The cool thing about this pedal is that clean blend. It's not just blending in the sound of the clean signal. It's on the right side there, it has clean tone. So that is kind of like a low pass filter and you can cut the highs. So I really like it. Gain is set, I mean, I'm sorry, yeah, drive or gain is set pretty low. Um, volume looks really low, but that's to equal the clean sound. And I have the tone at about five. Let's try it in G this time. I think it's a nice sound. Should we try turning the gain up a little bit, the drive? Let's play an A this time. That's got some wool on it. Let's turn it up to, what, three o'clock? Uh, why don't we play in C? And crank it, and I'm just gonna play. So I like that. I like that sound of the um, pretty woolly kind of sound. Okay, let's try it with a pick. I know you're gonna hate me for this, but I like playing with a pick. Using a Tortex Dunlop 1.0 millimeter. Not too heavy. Picking kind of between the neck and the P pickup. Let's see how it sounds. Maybe here we can hear some of the difference with the clean tone. Let's turn that up all the way and see what happens. Did you hear the sound of the pick and the strings and everything? Let's turn it all the way off. Let's turn the gain way up and see what happens. And then with this clean tone all the way up. All right, next we gotta try the fuzz. pretty good to me. I was messing with the clean tone because that's one of the things with this pedal. The clean blend works with the fuzz too. All right, one more thing. Gain all the way cranked. Clean blend on about five, like before, and let's listen to the sustain. The sustain. <laughs> Let's 
try that low E one more time. You could probably like, why did he let that go for so long? And it's because I had a request for a sustain. So I like this pedal. I like it more and more each time I play it. And um, I think it's great. I think it's like, you know, that this is what I've been waiting for, that clean tone option to be able to maintain the low end of your sound without um, having it, the high end of it kind of interfering with the overdriven part of the sound. So I think it's a pretty cool pedal. I'm going to keep working on it, working with it. And next experiment is with some octave. See what kind of sounds we can get there, but that's another video. So hope you enjoy this pedal review. All kinds of content here, but I like gear too, even if I try not to get too much. So if you want to send me free stuff, that's cool. Hit subscribe, hit like. Thanks a lot for watching.